Hello fellow moviegoers, movie watchers, tis I the rumpled one, movies I've watched. Blade Runner 2045, 164 minutes. Uh, okay, disappointed, disappointed, disappointed. Interesting storyline, but it was just so slow at times. I mean, I know it was for the effect and everything, but... You know, if you've got almost three hours to kill, <laughs> there you go. Den of Thieves. Good movie. Great ending. We got Gerard Butler. We got 50 Cent in it. Definitely, you know, entertaining. Twelve Strong. War movie. It's a true story. Pretty graphic. You know, people getting killed in it and everything. Well, it's a war movie. What do you expect? But um, some pretty good action. It's just some of the things just seem a little on the unbelievable side. You know, you've got a whole mountainside filled with guys with AK-47 automatic <laughs> rifles, right? And these guys are out in the open and these guys with the AKs just can't seem to hit the broad side of a barn. It just doesn't seem realistic. Just not at all. Okay, Fifty Shades Freed. The, uh... <laughs> oh, I don't know. I like the book, the first book, Fifty Shades of Grey, but, um... This one was kind of like, eh. You know, I, I'll have to give it to uh, Dakota Johnson, though. I think she's perfect in the role. She has the perfect look, the perfect demeanor. It just, I guess she just acts well but for, for this role. But uh, the movie, eh. Finally, Samson. <laughs> I'd almost give this movie a turkey rating. But... It's got Rutger Hauer, one of my favorite actors of all time. <laughs> but, um... Oh, I don't know. It's just one of these things It's just, you know, it's just not too believable. <laughs> but it is kind of amusing, I have to admit. You know. It's just, I mean, I think they've done the movie before. Did they really need to do it again? No. I mean, you could pretty much pass on this movie. I wouldn't recommend it, but, you know, unless you just like those old type movies from that time period. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, those are the movies I've watched. No real turkeys. You know, the thing about Blade Runner is I guess... Sometimes these type of movies, you got to watch them about two or three times to get all the nuances and everything. But, uh, it's just long. So, I hope you've enjoyed the movies that you've been watching. And as always, don't run out of popcorn. <laughs>